The CDC is adding COVID-19 shots to its list of recommended vaccines for children and adults. So what does that mean for your school age children? Well, Tucker Carlson has made a claim about that, and we have Paul Spay here to check that claim for PolitiFact. Will your kid need a COVID shot to go to school next year? That's what Fox News host Tucker Carlson said on his cable TV show. Take a look. So here's an amazing story that's been effectively buried. This week, the CDC's Advisory Committee on Immunization Practices is expected to add the COVID-19 vax to the list of required childhood vaccines. If this happens, your children will not be able to attend school without taking the COVID shot. That clip is from back in October, and Carlson was right about the CDC adding the COVID shot to its list of recommended vaccines for children. But he's exaggerating what that vote means. As the CDC pointed out on Twitter, your child's vaccine requirements are set by the state, not the CDC. Now, Carlson pointed out that some states like Vermont use CDC recommendations to set their policies. In practice, though, those states don't always require everything the CDC recommends. For example, the CDC's vaccination schedule includes the flu shot, but you can see over here, Vermont lists the flu shot as a recommendation down there in the corner and not a requirement. North Carolina doesn't fully follow the CDC's list either. The CDC says kids should get vaccinated for the flu, hepatitis A, and HPV, but you can see those shots are not on North Carolina's list of requirements. All of that is why the truth meter rates Carlson's claim, mostly false. Read our full fact check at WRL.com.